Hi everybody and welcome back. I am very privileged to be speaking to Guy who owns and runs the Power Equestrian Foundation here in the UK. Hello Guy. Hi David. How are you? I'm good. Good. Um, so would you like to tell me more about yourself or sure. about your foundation? So I myself am a Para Grade 1 rider yeah. um, and I compete internationally at three star level um, um, right. and became a Para about 25 years ago, following an accident with a horse, with okay. a head injury. Um, but I've only been riding again since that accident um, for about 13, 14 years. So tell me, what is Power Equestrian Foundation and what do you do? Yeah, so I started the foundation in during lockdown um, when we were privileged enough as international riders to be able to still ride our horses. We had uh, consent um, to ride them during lockdown. Uh, because we were training and hopefully waiting to competitions to gear back up. Um, and I realised that we were in a very fortunate position to be able to do that. And a lot of the riders that I have met along the way in the bronze and silver so classes the couldn't do that. So they were separated five, from their horses, separated from the riding, riding the and, um, winner, and we're missing it. So we started the foundation and it so well, exploded well, from there really. So yeah. we now look after riders from Great Britain, but also February. as far as Cambodia. We have it's riders in uh, New Zealand, Australia, the US, pretty much everywhere in the globe that, okay. that para riders compete. And we, all, we look after riders from and drivers, so uh, for every equestrian discipline. So we have endurance riders, we have um, dressage riders, obviously, show jumpers, drivers, vaulters, mm. pretty much everything where you have a horse and, yeah. and a para rider. And it ranges from supporting them with uh, performance management, and, and that's where I come in. So it's mindset work, it's um, performance management in terms of anxiety before a competition, uh, building your team around you, what you need as a power rider to be able to get down that centre line. Yeah. Um, everything from you know how how to find your horse, um, how to fund your horse, how to find your team around you. Um, we kind of look after all of that. Oh. So, uh, and as I say, it, it's pretty global now. Perfect. If someone wants to get involved, yep. how do you do that? So um, we're always looking for volunteers. We're always looking for people with fundraising ideas to take on challenges for us. We're very thankful that we're sponsored by Global Herbs, um, who supply all of our horses with supplements um, and supporters when we go to um, competition um, with team kit and all those kinds of things. So we're very grateful for that support, but we still have lots of vacancies for other companies to come in. Um, we're looking for a saddle company, for instance, to help us build the perfect para saddle that can go across multiple disciplines. Um, we've got a, a bridal wear company just coming on board um, and we've got various other professionals, um, but we still have room for far more than we than we um, we have now. So the best way to, to see what we do or to see how you can get involved is to have a look at our social media pages, which are Para Equestrian Foundation, or look at the website, which is paraequestrianfoundation.org. Um, and you can find out all about us on there and see how you can volunteer or get involved. Lastly, oh, what do you think of the like competition like here today? I mean, it's, it's fantastic. And yeah, what you have to remember is that we bring our international horses into this arena, and, and some of those are a little bit you know, upset at the atmosphere. And yet these fairly new riders, some of them, are bringing their horses in, and they're all performing brilliantly. So... I think hats off to them. They're doing yeah, a great right, job. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yes. So that is Guy from Power Equestrian Foundation. And well. if you want to find out more game. about her, I will have details of her website in the description down below. And thank you very much You're for welcome, speaking David. with me, Guy. Really and thanks for liking, everybody. Yep. Bye. Bye.